What's up everybody, what's going on? Thought I'd do another unboxing for you here. And what we have today is something, before I get to that, I don't understand YouTube and the way they do stuff and the way you try to put up thumbnails on, uh, on videos. I take a clip from the actual video and I try to put it into the thumbnail box when editing on your software. And it's always too big. The picture is always too big, no matter how much I try to make it smaller, it never fits right. If you can see my other videos where it's got a the black box around it, and most of the time it's just it gets so aggravating, I just don't fool with it, you know. If there is a way to make it simpler, like if I'm editing it and I come to the spot where I want to put that as my thumbnail, I should be able to click that, drag it to the box, and insert it. If y'all don't have simple stuff like that you know y'all make it complicated and difficult maybe most people it's easy because they do it all the time i'm not a computer expert never claim to be probably never will but could you make it a little bit easier youtube people also if there's a gun put the gun up there not three pictures of my face nobody wants to look at my face they'd rather look at the gun y'all need to people edit these look at these videos before they upload them Y'all can't pick better thumbnails or was it generated every 30, 40 seconds or whatever. I don't know. But whatever it is, YouTube, you need to do better at giving three choices for thumbnails or make it easier to put my own thumbnail in there. <clears throat> All right. Enough of that. Now on with the uh, unboxing here. I came across recently, I saw a, um, like a Heritage Rough Rider 16-inch barrel revolver. But... I decided to go with, uh, this is a Heritage Rough Rider, my, you know, so. Why well, I got this one, I'll show you here in a second. I think it's pretty cool. That's the main reason I got this particular one I got. So, uh, I'll hold it up here. Of course, you got your instructions and all that good stuff. And you got a thing here to get a holster at a discount price. Let's see here. Ooh. Go ahead and take it out the bag here. Let's take a look at this thing. Hopefully this video shows up pretty well. I didn't realize I'm wearing a black shirt, holding up a black gun, so. But the main reason I got this particular gun is right here. Nine shots of 22 Magnum. 22 Magnum. This has uh, nine shots of uh, 22 long rifle, but I opted to go with the uh, the one that had the two the two cylinders. See how this one here don't have no uh, grooves in it. But nine shots of 22 Magnum, nine shots of 22 long rifle. So uh, hopefully this video, like I said, turns out good. Didn't think with the shirt that I got here, but uh, yeah, single action. Safety's right here. Got to flip down. I know the gun's not loaded. But just make everybody happy here. I take the barrel out. There it is. Nine shots of 22 long rifle. Kind of looks like my uh, Ruger Blackhawk I got. But this is a safety on here. Flip it up, it's safe and down is on fire. It's got a little bar right in there. I don't know if you can see it. It rotates from like this to like that. So it's pretty cool. Let me put my 22 Magnum in there. I haven't put that one in there yet. Oh yeah. That's how you uh, change the barrel on here. Let's see what kind of trigger pull we got. It's not real light, but it's not real heavy either. But that should do it. Look at this thing. I like that grip right there. Some kind of wood. 
Let me see if it says it on here. Oh, let's see here. Coco Baloa. I don't know if that's the wood on here or the design of it. Then that's a nine shot revolver. But that's it right there. Never mind my face. So when I take this out to the range and do some shooting with it, don't worry, I'll have my camera with me too. Debating on what kind of holster. Should I get a leather holster or a nylon holster? What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Also, I got a bonus for you. I'm going to do another unboxing of a video. And if you could guess what's inside of here, I'll say congratulations to you. But that's going to be on my next unboxing. I'll see how this video goes as far as views goes and who could decide or guess what's in the, the big blue box that says Smith & Wesson on there. But until next time, everybody, this is this gun here. Probably take it hunting with me. This is like a backup or something like that. I know I carry my 44. But whenever I'm going through the woods, just like the clearing trails or anything like that, this might be a good thing to have, especially with the 22 Magnum in there. But yes, whenever I go to shoot this, I'll definitely have this uh, camera rolling here. And until next time, everybody be safe out there and God bless you.